Hello there everyone welcome back to Arts Authority today we will discuss about the topic are arts always busy in this video we will discuss about this topic in detail so let's start the video arts are always busy building deep tunnels collecting food taking care of the queen feeding larvae tending eggs protecting mounds bringing water to the nest burying dead fellows attacking prey or predators disinfecting bodies cleaning nest tending aphids and training new arts most probably you have seen arts moving from one place to another and running all around aimlessly as these busy creatures have a lot of things to do in their lives they can build deep and intricate channels within the mounds because they love to live deep in the soil it helps keep their bodies moist for a long and protected from predator attacks digging deep tunnels running around 20 feet in the depth of ground requires a lot of effort Many workers are involved in digging the soil with their bigger mandibles that can help move soil. Moreover, building a suitable nest for a colony can take several days to even months depending on the colony size and the number of insect involved. Some colony members work like cleaners and keep the floor of the mound clean of the fruit remains and non-eatables because these insects usually eat elusome and throw the remaining seed. Cleaners throw extra or non-eatable parts of seed out of the nest as they are responsible for keeping nest free of extra food materials and contaminating objects. In addition, their cleaning efforts help avoid the growth of harmful bacteria and fungi within mounds and protect them from the risk of infections. In the same way, they have to keep their bodies clean, particularly when they have wounds on their bodies as they lick their own bodies or fellows for disinfection. they have to keep the surface of eggs clean to avoid the risk of infection because these eggs cannot get mature or complete their metamorphosis stages due to fungal or bacterial infections ants are hard working insect who prepare for unfavorable weather conditions when they cannot find food in their surrounding areas most probably you have heard the famous story of the grasshopper and ants when the grasshopper begs for food from these little insects because it had not prepared itself for winter and food shortage accordingly they remain busy locating food sources breaking the bigger food chunks and hauling them back to the nest particularly in summer they store seeds fruits dead bodies of insects and even water for use in the winter when everything is supposed to be covered with snow a significant proportion of the colony workforce take care of the larvae and queens because they remain inactive most of the time These inactive members also include male ants because they only leave nest during mating. They get attracted to the females in the spring season and engage in a nuptial flight with the queen. Accordingly, they are busy collecting food for their nutrition and feeding the larvae and queen ants. The reproductive females and larvae can die due to starvation without food. The death of larvae and queen can negatively impact the colony's survival. and lead to the death of whole ant colony because there will be no workers to replace the dying ones they are known to build mutual relationship with many other insects for their benefit aphids and ants are engaged in a positive relationship when aphids produce honey dew to feed them these insects need sweet secretions to nourish and protect the soft bodied plant pest from predators accordingly you can consider that these insects are busy tending aphids for honey dew and protecting them after seeing them crawling on the plant stems it requires effort to fight with bigger prey and kill them to consume their bodies for nutrition these insect have the potential to fight as they can sting or bite their opponent some aggressive species of ants including fire and bullet ant are known to sting badly and cause swelling or redness on the affected area moreover they are known to kill prey a few minutes after multiple stings or bites injecting venom into their bodies and causing severe pain thanks for watching the video